With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Well, hello students. Now we're going to see this question. The question says that a particle starts from rest at t is equal to zero and undergoes acceleration as shown in the figure. Draw the velocity time graph of the motion of the particle during the interval from zero to four seconds. Okay, we need to draw the velocity of the graph. Let's suppose this is part A of the graph, part A, and this is part B. Okay, part B. Okay, so in part A, what is the motion basically? Part A is basically t is equal to zero to t is equal to two seconds. Okay, so basically in part A, what is happening? Part A u is equal to zero. Since it is constant acceleration of plus three and minus three, we will we can use the equations of motion. So u is equal to zero, a is equal to three meter per second square. Okay, v we don't know, and basically t will be equal to two seconds. So we will use the equation of motion that is v is equal to u plus at v equals u plus at. So from here, what we are gonna get? We will get v is equal to three into two, which will be equal to six meter per second. So if we draw the graph now, what will happen? So for drawing the graph, we need the axes. So we will draw the axes first of all. So let's suppose these are our axes. So now what will happen? Now we will plot the points. That is one, two, three, four, five, and six will be here. So I'll just extend the graph. So six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. And basically over here, one, two, three, and four. Okay. This is time. This is velocity, velocity. Okay, so over here, if you see, at I'll name the points right now. So this is point A, A. This is point B, this is point C, and this is point D. Okay, let's suppose I'll name it small A. So now we are gonna plot the points. Let's name it capital small B, small C, and small D, so that you don't get confused. So now if we see over here, the motion starts from Zero meter per second at t is equal to zero, so this will be a, and it ends at six meters at t is equal to two seconds, so this will be b, and b and c will be the same point because acceleration is just changing, so b and c will be the same points. So this is basically b, uh, the graph, what the graph will be. Okay, and lastly we will uh, do the part b of the question, that is part b, part b. For t is equal to two to four seconds. So what we have over here, we have u will be equal to six meter per second, and basically v we don't know. A will be equal to minus three meter per second square, and t will be equal to four minus two seconds, which is two seconds. Okay. So now what we are gonna do? We will use the again the first equation of motion that is v is equal to u plus at. U plus at, but now we will find v will be equal to six plus minus three into two, which will be equal to zero. So v will at four will be equal to zero. So the point will be here d. Okay. So if we draw the line, what we'll get? Get we will get a point like this. Okay. So this is the required graph, and this is basically the answer. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.